Yeah, he's one of the best bigs in the Big 12. Last year, his performance spoke for itself. This year, you know, uh, trying to get back in the fold. I think Coach is doing a nice job getting him back in. But they got other players that really stepped up, too. So uh, he's one of the best shot blockers in the Big 12. He's a physical uh, presence. I think he hung 40 on us last year in two games. So um, he's, he's been one of my favorite players in the Big 12. I don't enjoy coaching against him, but I have a lot of respect for him and his game. I guess just uh, some of the other guys. I know they, they've had Solomon Young who just uh, said that – or it was reported that he'll be out, obviously, yesterday. And then I guess just Cameron McGuire, what, what has he been able to do to kind of step in and be one of those guys like you talked Which about? Which player? Uh, the, what, the, the new center that they have. Yeah, he's uh, one of the best bigs in the Big 12. Yeah. He's averaging 14 and 7. He, if I voted today, he's an all-conference player. Um, skilled around the basket. Does a great job. Defensive help. So – Iowa State's uh, definitely one of the best teams in the Big 12. I think most coaches would tell you they're the best offensive team in the conference. Got four or five guys in double figures. Got at least three or four NBA prospects on this team. Coach Prone does a great job as always setting them up, putting them in spots, putting them in space to make plays. They're very, very difficult to guard. Um, I told our guys, you know, simply stated, we'll have to play the best 40 minutes um, of our season to this point to be competitive in this game. It was uh, Michael Jacobson, sorry. Uh, yeah, good player. Yeah, and then uh, Lindell Wigington, I guess, what what is he kind of posed for the, the perimeter guys that are trying to slow him down? It's a dynamic score. Uh, when anytime you can be an all-conference player in our league preseason as a sophomore, kind of speaks for itself. I know he went through the NBA process last year all the way to the last day and um, thought it was good for the Big 12 that he came back because he's certainly one of the best players in our league. Corpru exited the game against Texas. Uh, just what's kind of his status health-wise? Yeah, he's kind of day-to-day -day right now. He's got a calf strain, I believe. Uh, I expect him to practice this afternoon. Along those lines, uh, is, do we have an update on Moore and his progression? And do you possibly see him playing at some point this year? Yeah, absolutely. Still uh, you know, just trying to get him to the point where I think he could help the team. And so he's um, – Full, fully released the practice now. Um, you know, certainly kind of day to day, I guess, is the.